human beings function with assumptions that certain things are working. They're not going to be living in a situation where their home might be blown away by a storm, where a loved one will be driving down a street someplace only to have a huge tree fall on that car and kill that person. As these things become the norm, people will begin getting increasingly uncomfortable. If you look at the whole disaster record of humankind, people survive and cultures survive a single event quite well. It is compound events where there's two or more in a row. We don't seem to be able to handle the combination, and it's like a one-two punch. There'll be enormous pressure on the government to do something. It's the role of the government to protect the lives of its citizens. That's relatively easy when the threat comes from another human being or another country. It's extremely difficult when it comes from nature itself gone wild. So we're talking about a total breakdown, not only of global communities, national communities, state communities, even citywide local communities, into just small areas of people surviving. In a fairly short period of time, civilization as we know it will be gone. I think we would revert to tribalism very rapidly. If it's a permanent eye of the storm, then, you know, people can have a quite interesting existence. 